I'm Michael Beschloss, author of Presidents of War. The founders of our country wanted to make sure that the United States stayed out of wars unless they were absolutely necessary. When the founders were writing the Constitution, they knew that the monarchs and dictators of Europe had used war as a political tool. If the king was unpopular, he would invent some reason to go to war, and it would unite the people and it would give him more power. The founders tried to make sure that that would never happen in the United States. That's why they gave the constitutional power to declare war, not to presidents, but to Congress. They figured that with that proviso, the U.S. would never get into major wars unless they were absolutely essential. If the founders came back, they would be shocked that we have gotten into so many big wars, and some of them without a declaration of war by Congress. The last time Congress declared war was 1942, and we have gotten into a few major wars since then. The result is that modern presidents can take us into a big war for all sorts of reasons. They may do it at least in part to make themselves more powerful and popular. That is exactly what the founders were trying to avoid. 